and pass. Searching, but nowhere to go. And Just around midfield, he gets the punt away. And Newman, who is a speedster, tailing back, tailing back. Across the 40, got some room. Across the 50, still on his feet and brought down. The spiller to the bottom of your screen. Five receiver set and nowhere to go. Swallowed up very quickly. That was Justin Reagan, a five-yard loss on the sack. Of years of experience on this Jackson State staff. Second and 15. Reagan coming again. But instead, a number of blue jerseys come there to wrap him up. Continues to mount third and long for the Panthers. Stepping up in the pocket, rolling to his right. Jawan Pass decides to Look let out. it go. And the interception. I mean, this one here, just throwing it up for grabs. Yeah, you see yeah. the official there. That's, That's the, flag the flag right, right there. there. That's a tough break for Jackson State if they take away the interception because of that. So the Tigers started at their own 22-yard line, and there's Jason Dumas, the disruptor on defense for the Panthers. Loss of three. They don't have the best goal line. Dumas could be a factor. Well, Sanders here trying to survey the field, scrambling, still on his feet near the 30-yard line, and he's brought down. That's short of the sticks. Movement in the backfield. They quit swinging. Oh, Dumbo look, got him. Man wide open. That's the great offensive mind of Eric Dooley drawing it up. Jalen Howard with a little prime movement 35 yards later. And Prairie View's on the board first. Did the rest of the work. Um, this is a good job there. Knowing you're going to get hit, but when a receiver is that open, it doesn't matter if you're a wide receiver or a quarterback or running back with the pass, you're going to stand tall and deliver the football. And they knew that Jackson State was going to be super aggressive. Look at all the blue jerseys that flow to the football. And look at the two white jerseys that were open in the secondary. Had his choice of where to go with the football. Jalen Howard, the speedster, got open by himself and made the catch for the big play. Switching up the play calling from run to pass. Play action, man wide open, and there he is, Malachi Weidman. Read the scouting report. Weidman has 11 touchdowns on the season. Make it 12, cannot give him that much separation. The six foot five inch freshman from Venice, Florida, makes it look easy getting behind Jameis Presley or tackle for a loss. Then they start winning the battlefield position. And that's when they execute. And they are swarming very quickly. A number of jerseys. Devontae Davis. Y'all know what I'm saying? <laughs> we shout out Pops, right? Hey, well deserved. Well deserved. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Peyton Pickett on the carry. And, and Jay, we would be remiss if I would not shout out my partner up here. And Premier program in the NFL. Here's Pickett. Peyton Pickett still on his feet. Pickett won't go down. Buck down inside the 10-yard line. And they can't cover. That's too much cushion to give those guys. And Sanders looking on the outside, and it's intercepted in the end zone. That's Darius Campbell, the two-year starter, but they like to call him the Honey Badger. You can recognize this right now with the switch. That's the switch. But look at the hops to go up and get it. We're tied. And so on second and seven, Jawan Paz Look taking out. some time. Dangerous oh, throw, what a catch. but what an amazing grab. Wow, how did Jalen Howard come in with the football? Rule number one, you intercept the pass at its highest point. Don't let it get to you. He let it come into his bread basket, he thought, but no. The 37-yard attempt is good. And you can find a way to donate by what you saw on the screen. Go to v.org slash donate. Isaiah Bolden on the return. Skirts around. He's got some room across the 50, 40, 30, 20. He's gone. Into the end zone. Touchdown, Jackson State. How that crowd erupted after this 90-yard kickoff return for a touchdown. A missed tackle by the kicker, and then it was just the speed of Bolden outrunning everybody else from Prairie View a and and The Panthers had their work cut out for them, trying to figure out what can work. The play action, and there's Aubrey Miller. The Mizzou transfer, the hard hitter, loss of four. 
Sanders feeling the pressure. He's brought down. That's Jason Dumas. Pass. Got looking, looking. Has a man. Bad Dangerous throw. pass. Hung up in the air a little bit too long. Second INT of the ball game for Cameron Silman Craig. You see the running back come out of the backfield. This, this isn't going to end up getting the ball. He's coming out. Put it on him right now. Nobody there. Why lead him 30 yards down the field where you threw the ball to the safety rather than throw it to your running back that was open out of the backfield? Going to try to march it down the field. Looking, looking across the middle. And coming across the catch made by Travante Rucker. Like it. Second time around, the ball clearly left his grasp, but it never touched the ground, I don't believe. Sanders looking, has a man, and that was his tight end, Kylan Ritchie. Jay, attention to this as Jason Dumas not on the field here on this third and nine, but still trying to get to the quarterback and wrapping him up. That's Rashad Powell. He's the best pass rusher for the Panthers. Dooley said they had to win the battle on third down. Low snap, but gotten away by McGregor on the return. Look out. Here come the Panthers. There's some room and daylight for Darius Campbell. Campbell gets around another Jackson State player. That was the kicker. A 25 yard return. One of the greats to coach here. Jawan pass on third and nine from Prairie View AM. And took a blow Bumble. in the side. The ball is loose as Keontae Hampton delivered a blow. And Jackson State has come up with the football. All to us in great field position. Have to have better ball security in this one here. Cover it up with two hands right now. You have it in your left hand. Nice hit by the second team all swag linebacker, Keontae Hampton, who we know is a special player. Textbook tackle, ball comes loose. The defense trying to get it going for Jackson State. We see Keontae Hampton, who has been all over the field over Georgia. The numbers today for Bryce Young, it's 9 of 13 to 350 yards. And that one is intercepted and into the hands of James Houston. Coach Bond got exactly what he wanted. The turnover and the points to follow. You see him, you got to see him. That's not there. That, that, that's that's on the quarterback. Fantastic play by James Houston. Well, this is one when it's not there, throw it in the stands. You cannot do that. Carelessness. Has to punt it away here on fourth and ten. Darborn gets it away. Good punt. Warren Newman. Warren Newman. Watch out, ladies and gentlemen. Warren Newman cutting back. And a good return. This is probably the most important series of downs in the game for Prairie View. If the Jackson State scores, this place is going to erupt and it's going to get ugly. Well, it's Peyton Pickett who was able to pop on the outside and avoid a couple of tacklers. It was invaluable experience, and we seem to translate on the football field. Peyton with the carry, trying to get to the outside, and he's able to cross the goal line. Five yards in for the touchdown. He's been the difference, you know, designed inside run, but the speed to get out on the perimeter and finish off the run in the end zone. They wanted to get the running game going and that drive. Deliver the school's second SWAC championship since the title game started back in 1999. Here's Trazon Connolly, Connolly with room. Trazon Connolly, who's tripped up from behind. You can't expect that center to play a perfect game. You'd be happy with just a decent game. Coming from the backside and on the sack, that's Travion Green. Look out. And that one that's just got away from him. Justin Reagan is nearby to try to pick it up. And he secures it. Is that one just out of the hands of Trazon Connolly? We talked about this Jackson State defense. This one unforced, but five turnovers. And I always say this, and he hasn't told me he's going at all, but he's applied for that job every time he came over. We'll see, but great job for Prairie View. See, he's going to be a little short. The Southwestern Athletic Throne belongs to the new kings of the conference, the Jackson State Tigers.
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.